My name is Peter Bashar. I'm the general counsel of Marsh and McLennan. So we have a decent number now of alternative fee arrangements in which it's essentially some sort of a reduction on the hourly rate. But then in return, if you get a really great result, you actually get a premium over your hourly rate because that's the type of incentives that we want to try to create. Our business leaders quite enjoy it. If you say that, listen, if we get this case dismissed or if we execute this transaction within some defined period of time that is consistent with what their goals are, that the law firm wins in that process, that is just fine. We had a, a complex matter that involved some of the senior people in the organization. And we went to a law firm and we said, we would really like to get this case dismissed without discovery. And we will pay you a sizable premium if you can figure out how to get that done. And the lawyerly work on the case was just outstanding. And when it got dismissed, uh, we played, paid them a premium, and we're happy to do so. One vantage point that I have is I think there should be respect in both directions between the law firm and the in-house legal department. From my vantage point, simply paying your bill is not an acknowledgment of great service having been done. Uh, so at the end of the year, the team assembles a list, for example, of the probably the 10 lawyers who have provided really outstanding legal advice to Marsh Mack during the course of the year. And then I just personally call those people to say, as a former partner, I understand how hard you've been working to try to advance our interest, to make us look good in the legal department, to help us achieve our objectives. And I just want to express my appreciation to you. And just that from every aspect, how do you create the vibe between these two institutions that in fact our interests are really aligned? As a former partner, if I end up, end up in some sort of an alternative fee arrangement, I'm never going to try to really disadvantage the firm. If there's something that doesn't work out, we will try to adjust it in a fair way, whether it's on a future matter or the like. So really to just come in it with that spirit of partnership. Uh, and that, that's the, the holy grail that we're all reaching for.